Hey guys, so I'm going to look at MCAM Rig. Um, it's by Motion VFX. So I've done a few um, tutorials on their transition, their zoom transition, and the MLUT. Um, this is another one, MCAM Rig. So you just have to go to um, motionvfx.com. Um, you can type in MCAM Rig up in the search bar. So you come here and you just have to download it um, and just follow the prompts on the site. And uh, there are some tutorials also on this site. Once you download it, you'll find it in the titles, um, under titles. Okay, um, so you just search M Rig. So it's simple to use, you just have to drag it like a title on top of your clip. Okay, once you've got it in your timeline, you can open up the effects panel over here on the right. And here are all the parameters. There's a lot um, you can see, but I'm just going to leave it completely at default right now and just show you what it does at default. So what you can see there is that when it comes over the MCAM rig title, it zooms in and then it keeps playing the clip. And then when it gets to the end here, it zooms out. So you can play around with parameters here. I'm not going to go through all of them because there's a lot, but I'll just show you a few little techniques that I like to use. So the first one's here, in animation and out animation. So those are the in and out animations when it comes onto the title here. So if you don't have these selected, so say I'll deselect the in title, what it's going to do is just, it's just going to jump straight into the zoomed section. So there's no slow zooming into the position where it's set, okay? So it looks better, I reckon, with in animation and out animation. So I'm just going to leave them there. The other thing is you can change where it zooms into on your clip. So obviously this little circle here, this is where you want to slide to where you want it to zoom into. With regards to zooming in and out of the clip, so how much, uh, you can use this camera Z position, okay? Say so you don't want it to zoom in as much, I'm just going to reduce this number a bit to about, say, there. Okay, so I'll play that back. So it doesn't zoom in as much. If you wanted to zoom in more, you can just go, say, about there. It zooms in quite a bit. There's a few different ways you can use this title. So wherever you want it to zoom in and then zoom out, it depends on, obviously, the length of this title. So say I want it to zoom in when it gets past the girl here. So about here. So I want it to zoom in now. So it's going to zoom in because it's going to come onto the title. Okay. And then I want it to zoom out there. Or I want it to zoom out on the transition of the next clip. So you can extend this title so it just overlaps the next clip and then what that will do is it will have a transition so it will slowly zoom out to the next clip okay that's a pretty cool uh, little transition so yeah you can just have it on one clip um, zooming in and zooming out in certain parts or you can have it overlapping on another clip and then that will create a bit of a transition so what we're going to do is we'll zoom in on this uh, green boat and then as we're going to pass it we'll zoom back out so it comes back to the center so I just have to put the center here to the green boat. Okay, so it zooms in nice there. And then we want it to zoom out there. So what I'm going to do is I'm just going to drag this title to where I want it to zoom out. That's good. So we'll play that back. And that looks pretty good. Okay, so those are the very basics for the MCAM rig plugin. Um, you can play around with them. Go to Motion VFX and have a look at their tutorials. Um, you'll learn a bit from them as well. I just wanted to introduce it because I thought it was a pretty cool um, little plugin and it can help you out. Um, so, yeah, if you like the video, then subscribe, uh, like, or comment. Till next time, cheers.